And breaking overnight, Mother Nature out of control. Wild weather knocking down trees, causing big problems throughout the region. Two people were trapped when a tree crashed onto their home in Ambler, Montgomery County. Eyewitness News reporter Jan Carabello is live with more on the dramatic rescue playing out overnight. Hey, Jan. Jimmy Janelle, good morning. I was able to speak to a family member here. She tells me that eight members of her family live inside of this Ambler home. She says it was her grandparents who were trapped when this gigantic tree came crashing on top of her home. This home here, she tells me the grandparents taken to the hospital. The grandmother is expected to be okay. It's the grandfather they're really worried about today. At last check, he was in surgery. Now, this woman tells us her cousin, her cousin's boyfriend, and her cousin's four kids were also here in the home. They were able to get out, but you can see live here on the scene just how serious this all is. This is a gigantic tree. It's a backyard tree, 42 inches in diameter that came crashing down during the height of this storm overnight. It now rests on the driveway and the front yard this morning. If you take a look at the video, you can see Eyewitness News was on scene as first responders wheeled one of those grandparents out of this home and then took that person to the hospital for treatment. Fire and police were first dispatched to this home on the 100 block of Tennis Avenue just after midnight. Now, family tells us this tree fell onto the grandparents' second floor bedroom, and then that room collapsed onto the first floor where the cousin was staying. Again, that cousin, along with her four kids and her boyfriend, were all able to get out, and crews were eventually able to rescue the grandparents this morning. However, that was a tricky rescue because they had to cut through all of the branches that were blocking the driveway and the entrance to this home at the time. Now, understandably, the family did not want to speak to us on camera. They had to get back to the hospital. But listen to how neighbors describe this serious storm. Take a listen. It was about 11.30. It started to get, like, really windy and rainy, and it, it just flew through. You couldn't even see outside. It was horrendous. We were just getting ready to wake the family up to go to the basement, and it seemed to stop just as quick as it started. But then, like within 20 minutes, we heard all this. And that neighbor was very concerned about the kids that she knew lives here. The kids that live here, again, the four kids, the mother, that boyfriend able to get out. It was the two grandparents who were trapped. We are told they're in the hospital. That grandfather in the in surgery, we're still waiting on an update on his condition. But you can see it is pitch black out here this morning, except for our lights. A lot of power out because of a lot of down trees from Philly all the way to Ambler. At the height of this storm, we're told 40,000 customers in Montgomery County alone alone were in the dark. We'll keep you updated, but for, for now, we're live in Ambler, Jan Carabao, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Jim and Janelle, back into you. Certainly some frightening moments for that family. Jan, thanks very much.